So, we're back in Shibuya. It's not Halloween, and it's actually daytime, or at least what's left of day. And uh, we are outside of the Hachiko statue. Do you guys know the story of Hachiko? Okay, here we go. So essentially, long, not that long ago, there was a guy who would always come to the station and his dog Hachiko would follow him. This is a really short story. And every day Hachiko would meet him back at the station when the guy would come home. One day the guy actually died at the, in his office. He was a college, university professor, something like that, and he died. And every day, until Hachiko passed away, Hachiko would come to the station to meet him, even though he wasn't coming home. The most recent news, recently when it came to Hachiko, was the fact that the husband and, it wasn't really his wife, but his common-law wife, I guess if you want to call her that, were finally able to be buried together. I don't know where Hachiko's bones are, but let's go to Hachiko. <laughs> So as you could see, this will be really quick. There were a lot of people waiting around Hachiko. Essentially, Hachiko is the meeting spot of Shibuya Station, which is why everyone congregates there. So he's still waiting and we're all waiting with him now. <laughs> so we're gonna go do a little bit of walking around Shibuya and y'all get to come with us. Come on. That one right there. Yeah. They look like they do a little bit, a little bit of everything. So you know, paint, color pencils. They have Copic markers, which, oh my God, I like die for those things. I think they even do some sort of framing up on the second floor for pictures. But yeah, there's an art supply store here in Shibuya. It's so exciting. The only thing that would send me over the moon is if they saw my favorite paper, which is Bristol Smooth. But I guess we'll just have to see what we can make do with. But I guess I'll see you guys in the next segment. Art supplies! Oh my god. <laughs> they have lint chocolate. Oh my gosh. Well, we've been here twice, three times now, and it's the first time we've seen it. But they don't have much chocolate here in the way we do in America. So. Exciting. Okay. エレベーターは 
またこちらのエレベーターは3回終点階となっておりますバートのご移動がお近くの階段か右奥エスカレーターをご利用くださいませ I、uh, haven't seen it at night until now, which was really amazing.、Uh, seeing the whole Tokyo skyline, very nice. Actually, got to see Sky Tree in the distance. Hoping to get here before sunset. Didn't happen. Oh well.、Uh, so、got, a, got a Christmas shopping done.、Um, and this place is actually decorated quite nice for Christmas, which is surprising being November.、Uh, but honestly, overall, it's done quite nice. Mm -hmm. um, if you ever visit Tokyo, I recommend visiting the tower because you can ride it. We can't ride it all the way at the top right now, only because it's closed for renovations. But we did ride it to the、uh, middle point, which is 150 meters. The very top is 333 meters.、Uh, they've changed their business since 2008 since I last came, only because I think they're trying to get their attendance up because Skytree opened. But hey, still a great place to visit. Turn around, avoid it. So, this was actually my first time at Tokyo Tower.、Ah, Sorry. That hurt. Sorry. It is really cool to see Tokyo at night. Apparently, according to Kyle, if you get here during the day and it's clear enough, you can actually see Fuji, which it's dark. We couldn't see Fuji. But we'll have to do another trip in the daytime. But this was stunning. It was so cool, and I'm so glad we came. It was what, 900 yen to the first observation deck thing? Yeah. yeah so it's a fairly reasonable price, in my opinion. And plenty of shopping. Lots of shopping. And oh my god, the One Piece right now. The, okay. <laughs> But yeah, the whole area is kind of decorated for Christmas, which it's not overly done here, so it's. Actually, really kind of nice and classy, almost, I guess you could say. But we're also near the US Embassy if we ever have to come here, which is nice to know. <laughs> Or if they ever leave, I don't know yet.、Uh, we're gonna go get some dinner. We're wanting Indian food tonight, or at least I am. Cheese, naan. And we'll catch you guys in the next segment.